this week we have um, Velvet Buzzsaw. I wanted to do Arctic with Mads Mikkelsen, but there's no stunt people listed in IMDb for that. So I'm posting the IMDb, IMDb below for Velvet and um, Mike Smith, who is the stunt coordinator, his stunt reel for that. Um, so there's about 10 people total for, uh, for the stunt crew. So we have Jake Gyllenhaal and John Malkovich. I'll list all the talents and all the stunt people. But let's jump into it and uh, let's see the double takes for Velvet Buzzsaw. I'm just trying to make sure the picture's actually coming up. Okay. So we have, let's see, for this we have Jake Gyllenhaal, Billy Magnuson, Tony Collette, Natalia Dyer, John Malkovich, Rene Russo, and Zhao, Z-A-W-E, Ashton. It's a woman. Uh, for the stunt crew, we got Mike Smith, who's the coordinator. He's done Need for Speed. Uh, we have uh, stunt doubles here. Corinne Van Rick de Groot. Say that five times fast. Uh, she is Zhao Ashton's stunt double. She's done the Orville. Uh, she was actually a, uh, she was a policewoman in Canada for five years. And then she did military training, and then she turned to boxing before stunts. Then we have Alima Dorsey, uh, Ghostbusters 2016, Civil War. And then we have uh, uh, stunt double David Anthony, uh, David Anthony Buglioni, uh, Call of Duty and Rampage. Uh, David, I think Alima Dorsey is the stunt double for Zhao Ashton and David Anthony Buglioni is Jake Gyllenhaal's stunt double. Now, at the 1 minute and 30 mark is when we're going to start to see stunts. So, in about 15 seconds, you're going to start to see some stunts. I'll point them out to you. Uh, so far, we've seen, you know, some sexy bondage joke kind of. This is the art world. It's basically, these are art dealers and art critics and artists. you got some strangling here. you got truck stunts. Here's an obvious stunt. Man on fire. Look at that. Car stunts, truck stunts, fire stunts. Um, there's not a whole lot of stunts here, but what you just what you're seeing is most of what you're going to be seeing in this uh, movie for Netflix. Uh, uh, it's part CGI, part stunt, I think. But uh, most of this is, you know, for shocks and jocks. But it's basically the world of artists. Uh, I've been an artist since I was 18 years old, or actually 14 years old. I never made it. I never was inspired to be this sort of Hollywood um, kind of entrepreneur seeking kind of artist. I was never meant to be that kind of artist, painting big pictures and murals and canvases and sculptures to get the approval of, you know, Hollywood entrepreneurs. That was never me. But that's what this movie's about. It was never my thing. But uh, I, I want to show you the stunts one more time. But Mike Smith is in charge of all this. I'll show you the stunt at 1.30. Now this is for my 3DS. 2.51. Okay. Let me go back. If I could go back, if I dare to. Okay, this is that 117 mark. So yeah, all the stunts you're seeing here are fire stunts, truck stunts, uh, being thrown around a little bit. This is not a heavy action movie. This is, you know, all the actors you see, all the talents you see is basically that makes, makes up most of this movie. Um, you know, when you have like strangling here and the truck driving and the fire, that's a cool stunt right there. Look at that. And uh, the plowing into the, into the store. So there's not a lot. It's a very slow week for stunts, but um, I want to show off that much. And, um, you know, there are all kinds of stunt people. Sometimes you see them, sometimes you don't. And there are all kinds of movies and all kinds of stunt people in movies. Honor and respect your stunt doubles. Um, I'm not sure what... I think Alita... Is it Alita Battle Angels coming out? With the big eyes? Jesus. I can't stand those big eyes. But I will be recovering that movie before it comes out. But for now, we got Netflix movies to look at. So until then, uh, when next you see a movie, do a double take.